Welcome to update 8. You may recall in update 7 that I proudly presented the completion of my shifting system made up of about oh, 30 synchronized parts all powered by this finely crafted oak shifting handle. It was off to the presses to collect the compliments I was quite sure I'd received, but the only comment I actually received was a gentle reminder from somebody that the shifter was installed backwards. For, uh, move the handle forward for reverse and move the handle back for forward. I made up a vague excuse in my reply, but then I backpedaled in the second paragraph admitting that it was indeed a mistake. So I was off to my junk bins where I ventured to find the new parts I need to fix an obvious case of laziness. And this is what I came up with. Reposition parts, a few new ideas, uh, but now it works correctly. As you can see, back for reverse, forward for forward. So I got 30 finely tuned parts, all choreographed to move one small lever. Let's see back in there. Into only one of two positions, which seems to me to be a serious case of a perfect example of Rube Goldberg engineering. I figure simple is always better, but it's sometimes pretty complicated to make things simple. So what I intend to do now is to demanufacture this monstrosity and reduce this shifting process to something that's um, perhaps more logical and perhaps elegant. So stand by for the second part of this uh, video to find out how I reduce this uh, equation to its simplest parts.